delicious, my cream of vegetable, and parmesan soup. Mmm! You know you want some. Oh, yes, you do. You want some? Now. Gorgeous peeps in my universal world of peep. It's the Mama Cherry Show time. Oh, yeah. Welcome to the show. How you doing? I hope you're doing well. I'm listening. All right. Put it up. There you go. That's it. Thumbs up. I just want to know you're doing okay out there. All right. So, in case you guys know, Katrina has been off the radar for a while now. She's been ill. But we have... On the camera today, we have the one and only Tyler. Come in and say hi, Tyler. Say hello. Hello. There you go. So Tyler's on the, he's, he's, he's on my camera. He cameraman today. She, he, they cameraman today. So, what are we making today, you may ask me? Well, I ain't going to tell you until after you hit that button. Come on, hit that button. Subscribe right now. Now, I'm going to tell you whether you subscribe or not, but it would be nice if you did. Today, I went through my fridge, and lo and behold, you know, sometimes you go through your fridge and you think, you know, you only got about it, three more hours left of that piece of veg because it's coming to the end of the show. But y'all know me. I don't bend it. I spin it. Oh, yes, I do. I find a way to use everything. Because that's what we got to learn to do. Our planet is going away if we're not careful. So we have to use the resources that we have. And that means don't be throwing stuff away. Now, I have here a carrot. I got this old manky looking courgette zucchini. I got a half of leek that look like it's growing out of itself. Oh yeah, my broccoli ain't the green as it could be. And these parsnips, oh Lord have mercy, they have seen better days. But, I'm going to show you what you do. You don't throw it away. You put it all in the pot, you boil it up, and you make yourself a lovely cream of vegetable soup. So that's what we're going to do right now. So let me show you what you got to do. First thing you got to do is, obviously, you got to get rid of the bad parts. So, just cut that off. Because if you look on the inside, ain't nothing wrong with the inside. It's just the outside. And there, that end is a little bit soft. You can see it's a little bit of gappy up in there. So I'm going to cut that bit off. There you go. Get down to the firm. Then, I'm going to cut it in half. And we're going to just throw it in the pot. That's it. One vegetable down. We're going to get our carrot. I'm just going to skin it down just a bit. And I'm going to cut this up. Now the carrot, obviously, is the most dense of our vegetables here. So you make sure you cut them a little bit small. Now I'm going to go for our leeks. Let's get that end off. And can you look how beautiful and green it is on the inside? So if we do like this, we can just peel off. Look at this. Now look at the difference. Boom! Ain't nothing wrong with that leek. <coughs> Excuse me. So let's cut this leek up. And let's get it in the pot. Next, I got a half an onion. So let's use that. Because, I mean, I could use it or I would find around, I'll look around three days time that onion then sat there and gone all dry. So let's use it now. Onion. Go it in the pot. Boom. Broccoli. Oh my goodness, this poor broccoli is looking a little bit sad. So, we're going to cut off that woody end, okay, and then I'm going to just take my knife, and what I do is I like hold that, if you hold your broccoli real tight like that, all you got to do is then just 
skim over. Gently skim over. Just like that. Can you see that green coming through? Yeah, you can, yeah. Go, can you, can you see it, Todd? Yeah. Oh, they can see that. Can you, look at that. Look what's happening underneath there. Goodness. Okay. Let's get this bit here. Let's just get that top layer off. Nice. Ain't nothing wrong with that broccoli. Just a little bit dry. So, now let's just cut this up. Cut it. Cut it. Pull it over. And let's just break it in. Okay. And now, our parsnips. Let's get that. And look how lovely and white those are. Can you see that inside? And this, normally, you would just throw this away. I'm going to go get me a peeler, just so I can take that outer side off. Hold on, guys. Be right back. My peeler. Peeler, peeler. Where my peeler? Here's my peeler. Here's my peeler. So, let's just peel this off. Okay, can you see? Look at that. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Let's turn this. Other than I just left it in the fridge for way too long. But I know anybody other than me would have just thrown these in the bin in this household. Yeah. <laughs> they would have. You would have, wouldn't you, Ty? Yeah. Waste of food. And now, let's just go like this. Put it in. And then I have here just a stock cube. Just a vegetable stock cube. So let's get this into our pot. Mm. <laughs> here we go. Just break this up. And then I'm just going to just add some water. Just plain water. Little bit more seasoning there and mama's love dust love dust baby yeah and then ain't nothing but to do it put it on to the stove let's turn it on let's give that a stir and we're just going to let that boil away until it reduces down just a touch. All the vegetables get very soft. And then we're going to add some blue cheese to it. Um, and some sour cream to make a really creamy vegetable cheesy soup. So we'll be back to you in a minute. Hello guys, welcome back. Well guess what? Boom! Our vegetables have boiled. Now, <laughs> I'll tell you, fill you a little story. We popped out to the shops because I needed a few bits and pieces and we just got a little bit busy. And I went, oh my God, I forgot I got my soup cooking. But I did put enough stock in it so it is fine. So you just want to get it. And you and really, actually, this is probably for the best because you really want to get it as soft as you can. Now, um, I probably didn't do it on camera, but I did add a touch of salt. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to blend this. So, we're going to go in with our stick blender and head it straight to the bottom. And then just kind of get it blended. Let it go. Let it go. Let it blend. Because we need it all mushed up. Let it blend. Let it blend. Okay. some sour cream and 
and some single cream. And I did say this was going to be with cheese and we're going to add a touch of blue cheese. Just some Stilton. This is a blue mature Stilton. Do you like cheese, Tyler? I don't think I've had blue cheese. No? No. Well, I don't really like blue cheese as blue cheese, blue cheese, but in a sauce, it's so it tends to be okay. Mm -hmm. So let's see. Let's see how we go. Let's just get it all whipped up. in here and we're going to try it okay let me see hope it's not too cheesy oh that's pretty good actually mmm mmm where's my black pepper mm. uh, right there in front of you oh great yeah a little bit of black pepper and then I also have these parmesan shavings which we can put over the top so, actually, let me, let me put some soup in this bowl. Because we're going to taste it. Oh, yeah. A little bit of Parmesan on the top. Yeah. Yeah. Let try just, it. Let me take a little. Come here. Try it. A tasty taste. Take a little taste. Come in here. Let's get you in. So they can see you. Ooh. Oh, that's your, really good. Bend your head in. What do you think? That's really good. I thought it was going to be a bit too cheesy, but that's It's not that's cheesy amazing. at all. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. That's, that's so nice. That's really good, isn't it? Mmm. Oh. Mmm. That's delicious. Yeah. So, people, put a little bit of peace. A whole lot of love and soul from the mama. Goodbye.